This is Ben from Testive, and we're looking at a multiple choice, multiple answer question for the ACT. When we get a question like this with the Roman numerals, we should mark uh, which ones are true and false, and then just figure out the answer by uh, putting those together. This says, which of the following best describes what the interjection in lines 37 to 38 reveals about the man? Okay, so the man being Simon, so let's look at 37 to 38 and see what this interjection is. Uh, let's see here. Uh, but the dragonfly went round and round. It never settled anywhere. Of course not, happily not, or I shouldn't be walking here with Eleanor and the children. Uh, so it's the, the interjection would be between the dashes, so the of course not, happily not, or I shouldn't be walking here with Eleanor and the children. Okay, so basically it's saying that the dragonfly uh, didn't land, and uh, if it, uh, because of that, um, had it landed, he wouldn't be here with Eleanor and the children. Uh, so let's see which of these is true or not. One, the man believes the dragonfly, okay, so far we're in the right ballpark, is an omen which predicted many years ago how happy he would be by Eleanor's side. Uh, I think that this is not exactly true. Um, because really it's, it's, he had thought the dragonfly would be an omen um, that he wasn't going to marry this other woman, Lily, uh, not that he was going to be happy with Eleanor. So you could get kind of tricked by that, but, but I don't think that's right. Two, the man rejoices that his destiny was always to be with Eleanor and not with Lily, who has rejected him. Uh, maybe, uh, maybe, I don't know if I would say that he rejoices, uh, it's an interjection, so it's kind of an aside in between a thought that's a little bit uh, more contemplative. Uh, so, and, and I'm not sure if he was saying his destiny was always to be with Eleanor, because really he's thinking back as to a different path his life could have taken. Uh, three, the man, and so if we wanted to be bold here, we could just choose this one. Um, uh, but let's check. The man attempts to convince himself that his life is better with Eleanor than it would have been with Lily, but is only somewhat successful. Okay, sure. So he's kind of interjecting in this in this thoughtful moment, and he's saying, well, you know, of course it's okay that the dragonfly didn't land, uh, and he kind of follows that up by saying happily. So I would say somewhat successful is a good description here. So we'll say this one's true, and that the answer is just 0.3. Uh, and just you can notice that two and three is not an option, two and three together. So the fact that we were unsure about two ends up being fine.